Hello everybody, welcome to Impressive Image Maker channel. This is Toshi Yagi from beautiful little island, Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer, I shot this image for a couple years ago, and uh, I have this image and also, okay, this pencil drawing type image by Adobe Photoshop used to filter called Find Edges. And uh, I'm gonna make something interesting hopefully impressive image to make these images okay I'm thinking about well let's check from the this pencil drawing type image turn it on then change blend mode to check it out okay let's get started now it's normal image to now go dark, uh, darken we can see through underneath of the image so we see the black lines on the lips okay multiply collaborate this is nice skin tone huh linear burn screen overlay change opacity some Pin light. This is interesting effect. We got the nice key light from behind. Subtract. Divide. Emphasize some white from light and the key light, huh? Divide. Divide 50%. I remember that. Okay. Oh, this one. Yeah. Nice highlight. On her hair and uh, lips, hue, saturation, color, then luminosity. Luminosity, pretty interesting. Colors and stuff. Well, let's go for this luminosity. That's, yeah, I think, interesting. And uh, I'm gonna base image for this luminosity and I add some colors on the shadow side. And uh, I'm going to change some, play around with this mirror ball, add colors, colorful colors on something. Well, okay, now I'm going to start from here. Select multiple, one, two, base and a pencil drawing image. Then I make, well, du duplicate layers. Now let's see, March selected. Now I fix this image. Then again, I'm gonna duplicate this layer, two layers, then one of the top of them. This layer, I'm gonna change the blend mode, normal to multiply, so it goes dark. So I'm gonna, let me see, turn just a little bit down. This is normal image, then this one is. Just a touch, okay, 60% or, yeah, looking at this one, just combine the image a little, a little bit light. So I'm gonna add this to get a little bit more density. Okay, I'm gonna march down. Now I got this image for base. Then again, well, just turn it off. Then let's see, this pencil drawing type image, change to divide, was it? nice highlight key light and uh, lips this is nice a little bit to emphasize 70 percent so we got the nice highlight okay now again select multiple one and two then duplicate layers now i'm gonna select uh march selected to get one i'm gonna use only key light highlight later on from this image now we just will keep it okay and uh, this pencil drawing type I'm gonna bring this one back to normal well go back to maybe dark so we can see it through underneath then I'm gonna move this layer go up to top then just well turn it down now turn it off now we are looking at the base image right okay i'm going to duplicate layer then base image 
just turn it off to keep it. Then I'm going to work on this copy of the base image. Now, I'm going to well use it uh, this time. Use the oil paint like, yeah, okay. Now I'm going to oil paint type texture. So I'm going to use oil paint round first and no color, just texture of the brush on this base image. That's right. I gotta convert to pixel layer to touch this. That's, um, I like about this oil paint is this mixing, paint mix, color mix with the best next color, next pixels. Like, let's see, when you add some color, like, let's see. I'm going to choose a little bit dark blue then I add some this shadow area it's going to mix with next color which is now kind of brownish color that's real neat change the brush like oil paint detail already mixing with the next pixels color okay I'm gonna use later on now I go oh this is too small I think okay go for details later now I'm gonna just using the toy paint flat no color just just like smudge Okay, overall, look, uh, let's see. Nice blue work color here, so I want to use the same blue work color. A little bit purple. Red in it. Let's see, color wise, just complementary color. A little bit orangerish. Now let's see, no colors again. Now change the brush to Filbert. Now change it to oil paint chunky. I'm go for overall image. Let's see about shadows. Now overall around here I can smudge later, touch up later. Now I'm gonna open up this image. This one was the let's see turn on. The color of the luminosity was it? Let me turn this one off. Let me check this one. This is okay. This one is divine. I got this highlight texture I'm gonna get. Well, I can make mask now. Alright, create empty mask, invert mask. Now I'm gonna reveal this. Let's see. 
this is the mask we see some highlight maybe I should add some kind of uh, some kind of color on here huh? let's see again on and off okay now I don't know if I can put on um, color on this image let me see let's try just test yeah we can go there mm -hmm. make it different colors huh okay now let's see well if I add some different colors okay okay again I'm gonna touch up later on this mm -hmm. okay now this one this one is on we see the effect of that overall image huh? let's see change the blend mode how it's gonna looks like wow color burn that's pretty interesting yeah really impressive huh how's it look hey that's cool 50% hmm okay just give it let's see catch up I mean the cat light hmm well just basic to hard round variable just add white catch light okay now I want to keep just save this image just the way okay this is today's work number one just keep it save duplicate rename open okay I just save this image as uh, one of them one of today's work now I want to change this this blend mode color burn to okay now I change the blend mode on this image luminosity 75% now I'm gonna turn on this pencil drawing type image turn on it's darken well not much excite me so I'm gonna turn this one I'm going back to normal and turn it off now now let's continue to change this second layer oops I'm gonna turn this one off now I'm gonna work on this second one again luminosity opacity 75 maybe 80 let's see to the blend mode overlay let's see hmm this hue is okay kind of interesting let me touch up here huh? some no paint just smudging all around here i'm gonna just finish up touch up just get the brush texture all right took a little while okay now let's see uh, I don't know if I want to add some color on this mirror ball still have time so let's see again this one is now here to change saturation Here's a nice color around here, huh? But yeah, oh, well, they give us more contrast. Let's see, just play around and layer. Then, well, change the brush to, let's see, basic to soft round flow to give it some uh, add layer on here 
Yeah, let's see how it looks like. Give it a boom. Then change blend mode to color. Mm, that's about it. Come down. Just blue color. Blue cast. Yeah, that's about it. I'm gonna change this. Um, nothing interesting. Yeah, I knew not much. How about move this one down? Just over the base image. Then let's see this. Turn it off. Or maybe color burnt. Going back to color burn. About 50. Then just add this color. That will make sense. Okay. Little cast, huh? Okay. Let's see now. In this case, I'm gonna play around with this color. Yeah, just leave it color and uh, let's see if I change to... Some other colors. Let's see about this base image. Normal 100%. This is for mirror ball color. This around here. Yeah, about the same kind of cast here. Okay, then this one is. Oh, well, this one is normal. Oh, here. I got the uh, highlight effect. Right, this one. That's nice. And uh, this is color burn, which is main effect of the overall. This shows this much, huh? The difference between first image is I, which I um, saved already, is the color of the mirror ball. That's all I. Uh, that's the difference, and I touched up. So now, what I can do? This is pretty good, and I want to see some more. Maybe changing this color burn too. Well, I saw that pretty impressive image already, so other image is not that effective, attractive. Vivid light. Hmm. This is pretty much, maybe, about 30%. A little bit lighter image. Yeah, this is a little bit different. Well, how about turn this one to, okay, 30%. Now fix this image, then let's see the pencil drawing type image to darken or something. Okay, now last thing, variation. I have this image, vivid light, select multiple, one, two, three, four layers. Now duplicate layers, merge selected, I fixed. So I'm going to turn the other images off. Well, we don't see this bottom, so don't worry about this. Then just fix this image and also let me... Okay, now fix this image already, so I'm going to turn on this pencil drawing type image now. Then let's go darken or multiply. Well, that one's fine. Now I'm gonna make create empty mask. Then, well, just hide to her lips and face. I don't want to get this dog dot from here. Okay. Now, so highlight of her hair. 
You don't need the black lines. Okay. Durable. Well, that's mm, that much. That's fine. Well, I like the outlines. Okay. I guess that's about it, maybe. Well, let's see that uh, change blend mode. I got lines already now. Let's see what's gonna, how it uh, looks like. Well, mask density off. Then let's see, change the blend mode. Hmm, I kind of like saddle tone. Well, interesting. Let's see, let's see this mask. I'm gonna choose soft round size flow. Hmm, I kind of like this kind of soft light image. Not bad. Well, I just want to see. Let me see. Duplicate this layer, then turn it off. One of this, just for compare. Now I'm gonna work on this layer. Just opacity 100%. Then I want to smudge this grains with well basic to maybe soft round size flow same brush. Now let's see. Ooh, smudging and moving. That's interesting texture. Wow! Wow! Interesting. Look at these outside lines. Just moving. Hmm. That's interesting. Give it a something, some kind of movement. Mm hmm. Look at this. Well, well. No winding again. All right. Interesting. Pastel color. Well, now let's see. Move this one just down bottom of this image. Then I'm gonna turn on. Then just go back, darken on this layer. So we see straight image. Well, darken. Mask, oh, mask density go up, so we're not gonna see the black that down her face. Then opacity up. Well, that's interesting image I got now. Well, well. This one mask density. What mask? Oh, inside, huh? Okay, well. Take this out. Not go that way, huh? Only luminosity. Yeah, 40% then. Okay. Well, this is it, I think. Let's see, turn this on and off. This is the luminosity, huh? This is nice too, without this layer. Okay, I'm gonna save this one and also save this one just as a variation now huh? okay well thank you for watching my video and uh, i hope this movie is going to give you some kind of idea for your creative work well try something different and uh, i really appreciate for you guys support and uh, well you guys have a nice day and see you next time bye now ciao yeah, that's interesting, isn't it? All right.